Hello everyone, very warm welcome. Hello church, hello family of God, hello friends. If you're joining us here at Grace Community Church in Edenbridge, we're so glad you can be with us in this way. My name's Dave White and I lead the church here and uh, I hope that you're going to be blessed and encouraged as we worship together in a number of uh, worship songs that we've prepared and then hear God's word as Sam and Floor share with us from Mark chapter 4. We've also got a bit of news for you this week. Some of you will have already heard this. We are planning to hold our first outdoor worship service here in Eden Bridge at Grace Community Church next week on the 20th of September. Uh, circumstances allowing and uh, God willing, that's what we, we plan to do. So if you do want to come along, do get in touch uh, with us. Uh, it will be a first come, first serve basis because we will be keeping to uh, social distancing and making sure our meeting is COVID secure. But it will be good to gather together uh, like that uh, for the first time. And uh, um, before we move on, uh, I'd like to uh, just pray for us and uh, pray for our community. And I invite you to join with me uh, as I just commit this time uh, to the Lord and commit our community to the Lord and one another to the Lord. Father, thank you that we can come in your name uh, to you. Thank you for sending your son Jesus who has made the way for us and we do commit ourselves to you, we commit our plans to you and we ask you Father that you would, as you taught us, that you would deliver us from evil, that you would keep us safe in this pandemic time uh, that uh, you would keep uh, us in the church safe, that you'll keep our community safe, you keep this uh, this nation uh, from the ravages of this virus. We ask in your name for your kingdom to come, uh, your will, we, will to be done. We pray in your name. We pray for those who are more vulnerable in our society. We ask you, Lord, help them, strengthen them, uh, give the society, uh, give the people in this community, give the church uh, the strength to uh, reach out and help and uh, assist those who are more vulnerable. We ask in your name for a spread of mercy and peace and grace in this community. We pray in the name of Jesus. Amen. Just before we move on, let me just share with you uh, some words from Paul as he was writing to Timothy to just help to focus us as we come to worship. Paul writes this in 1 Timothy chapter 1. The saying is trustworthy and deserving of full acceptance that Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners. And then a few verses later, he writes to the king of ages, immortal, invisible, the only God, be honour and glory for ever and ever. Amen. To the king of ages, Jesus Christ, immortal, invisible, the only God. Be honour and glory for ever and ever. Amen. Let's come with that attitude of worship and honour and praise and giving glory to the one who sits on the throne. Thank you. And uh, I'll hand over to those who are leading us in worship now. Thank you. gift of grace is Jesus my Redeemer. There is no more for heaven now to give. He is my joy, my righteousness and freedom, my steadfast love, my deep and boundless peace. To this I
Chosen me, love has called. 